actually started as a project as a, a very small commission for the Center for Craft as a thank you gift um, to someone who's leaving their board and someone who had also been a professor of mine. So we had sort of a mutual connection. But then I just kept exploring it. So um, this is what oh, yeah. one of them looks like. Nice. And then it's reversible, which oh, is what's okay. so interesting. Yeah. So this is the summer side because it's like the lighter yeah. um, threads are coming through or predominant. And this is the winter, so mm -hmm. it's darker. So I just played around with that. This is like a rose style. Mm -hmm. And then the same um, threading of the loom, you can get a rose fashion, which is what I just showed, or you can get a star fashion. Mm -hmm. So it's the same pattern, the same structure. You just... Um, you, you interact with the loom in a different way to get these two different visual mm -hmm. uh, things from the same pattern. So just playing around with that, putting them together, having them be a separate, different colorways. So, oh, yeah. 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 Awesome. That was my latest project. Yeah. And is that an, yeah. is that an Appalachian pattern or no? Um, well, uh, there are definitely coverlets and blankets woven with, with these patterns and many others. I mean, this structure gets really pictorial really um, easily. Yeah, okay. Uh, like pine trees are a kind of common motif yeah. that you see. That makes sense. Uh, it's, yeah, it's also the way, and I'm not an expert on this, but um, I'm, I just, I think this is how most jacquard looms uh, the structure that most of them did. So once you start getting a little bit more automate, automation mm -hmm. on a loom, you can get really pictorial. Mm -hmm. um, and I think it uses this structure. So I think a lot of historic coverlets, um, especially from the Northeast, are summer and winter. Nice. Um, I think they're definitely a part of this region's like material cultural history. Uh, but I don't know if they're as quite um, singular as the overshot is like perceived to be the overshot is also can be claimed by many people too yeah um, we just really preserved it in a particular way so can you turn your computer yeah. to see i can see half of the sign that's behind you and i just want to see what it says oh nice sweet yeah <laughs> that's from that's from college that's my like um bfa uh exhibition yeah or exhibit poster awesome um yeah it was great we all did different um like um what's the word i'm looking for engaged with different materials and we performed making those materials in the in the room cool. and a lot of people thought that was really fun because it was a little it's a nice break from a lot of the static rooms of quiet art yeah we made noise yeah